Hello and welcome to this Dr. Ross Mass key skill video on using free letter angle notation. Now sometimes we've got a diagram and we call the different corners in the diagram the vertices, the singular is vertex, and we've got different lines or edges. And we want to find the angle between two lines. So we might, for example, want this angle. So we want to find the angle between this line and this line, and that's the angle between those two lines. Now, there's a naming convention in terms of how we can refer to these angles. So let's just look at x first, and how we're going to refer to this angle x. We don't know the value, but we can still refer to where that angle is in the diagram. And the way we do that is if we highlight the two lines, either side of the angle, so either side of the x, then just read off the letters starting at one end of this double line to the other. So we've got B, A, C. So we can refer to this as angle B, A, C. Sometimes you also see it written as B, A, C with a little carrot above the A in the middle. So that would also mean angle B, A, C, but it doesn't matter which way. But the, the point is, is the order of the letters will still be the same. We could also refer to this using the other direction, C, A, B, and that would be the same angle. What about Y? How could we refer to this angle here? Well, if we do the same thing, if we look at the two lines either side of the Y, so it's these two lines here, that line and that line that we've got the angle between, then if we start from one end of this double line, let's start here, for example, we've got B, C, A. So it's angle B, C, A. Or if we prefer, we can put a little carrot above the C. And finally, angle Z. We want the angle between this line and this line. And if you're a bit confused how I'm getting these two lines, just start from the vertex where this angle is and sort of fire out across those two lines. And then we just start at one end of this double line, let's say here, and read off the letters, the vertices. A, D, C. So this is angle A, D, C. Or if we went the other way, C, D, A.